a four-year-old child po. Oh, so kasi talino ni Barak ang isang kindergarten student. Now, mga kuya mga ate, don't have to be scared of Barak po. We promise you, hindi yan ang nangagat. Mas delikado pa si Kuya Gmart. Ito pa na sa tumulang Alright, now, ladies and gentlemen, Barak, that's what we call Psychodactyl B. Psychodactyl meaning two in the front, two in the back, allowing them to grab items. And as we've shown you, Barak's impressive feet behind the table, we have a... Kanang kanang ay traditional Filipino footwear, so boy. So on, bakay. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen, that is the side of the Filipino footwear. Let's get to the front, to the back, allowing them to grab tight. And so much again, right, left, right, left, and back, back. Good boy. Now, high five. Up here, back up here. Good boy. Now, folks, that is what they use to perch high up on the spot. Now, not only is para fashion conscious, but he is also environmentally conscious as well. Now, let me ask the audience and be honest, okay? Who here segregates their trash? Or kinsay nag-segregate sa itong basura today? Raise your hand to ask them out. Okay, we have Kuya, we have Ate, we have Kuya, we have Ate, we have Kuya, we have Mom, we have Ate, we have Kuya, we have all drop trash on the table, and we'll see how Barak segregates his mess. So that will all learn a valuable lesson from him. So Barak, ready? Kuyajima, ready? Okay. Kuyajima, Daga. And let's see what Barak picks up first. It looks like a piece of plastic, which is going to... Oh, what is Barak? There we go. The piece of plastic is going to go to one down by a degrade of all of it. Up next, it looks like another piece of plastic, which is once again going to the non-biodegradable bin. Good boy. And let's see what he picks up next. It looks like a leap or down, which is obviously going to the biodegradable bin. So one last piece of trash going to get table nice and clean. And the last leap is gonna go to the biodegradable bin, ladies and gentlemen. Hopefully everyone learned a valuable lesson in helping our environment. Oh, kung kaya sa hayo, kaya sa tao. Now let's all take Barak's leap, folks. Thank you so much for that boy. Now, kiss to you, Marquis. Boy. And again, folks, Barak is a certified genius, but with intelligence comes moodiness, and Barak wants to go home and out. So, uh, I need everyone to wave Barak a bye-bye. Please wave Barak bye-bye, and there we go. Wave Barak bye-bye, and uh, Barak, wave everyone bye-bye. Barak! Uy! Okay, kasi plado ba niyo, boy? Kasi plado ba? Okay. When he does his head tilt, folks, it means he wants to stay in the show. But of course, we need to highlight our other animals naman, no? So, uh, let's just give Barak and Kuya Jimar the round of applause that they deserve to post. Thank you so much, Barak. And of course, we have Jimar. Alright, next is what? Good girl, Amiga. Now, folks, that is Amiga, our Eclectus Parrot. Now, Eclectus Parrots have what we call sexual dimorphism. Sexual dimorphism is when two sexes of the same species look completely different. Oh, so, male Eclectus Parrots are actually green and blue, while females are red and purple. So, that is how you tell the difference between the sexes of Eclectus Parrots. Oh, now, we will see how Amiga interacts with her environment using her pretty hand size. By raising the flag of Davao Crop Park and Zeus Amiga, kita as ang bandera ng Davao Crop Park. Go! Pira girl! Pull! Gila! Sige na, isa pa! Pag-uwi kayo sa iron, meron ka vlog na WD40 at ang mga vlog. There we go! Ladies and gentlemen, once again, that is how she interacts with her environment. Using her prehensile beak. Her feet are very much like our fingers, and her thumb is very much like our thumbs through folks. Now, uh, let's give Amiga and Kuya Silent a round of applause, please. There we go. Thank you so much, Kuya Silent, and of course, Amiga. All right, we have seen us in Jumbo. Now, folks, let me tell you this. Unfortunately, 70% of our air pollution comes from our transportation. So our cars, our motorcycles, our buses all contribute to global warming. Pero, as we've shown, we know the net way to commute to work or to commute to school to lessen our carbon footprints. Jumbo has there behind the table a bicycle. And let's see how Jumbo uses this. So, boy, sakai. Boy, sakai. Ah, sakai. Watch out. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen. That is the once again, to the front, to the back, allowing them to grab items in Parallel Good Boy Jumbo Now, to the kids out there, or maybe some of the adults who still don't know how to ride a bicycle Nothing to worry about, but because we also have a scooter And let's see how Jumbo uses this So, boys, I'm fine Watch out! Oh, they don't cross the stable Parallel Good Boy Jumbo Now, 
Ladies and gentlemen, those are the alternate ways for us to commute to work or to commute to school to lessen our carbon footprints. And you may have noticed that Jumbo is happy this afternoon. But you can tell by checking out the cram or press on his head, which will raise or lower depending on his food. Now, folks, let's give a jump.